Good afternoon. Welcome to Tea Time. Today we're going to talk about fear. And I'm looking forward to sharing with you what the Lord has laid on my heart. Are you afraid today? Is COVID crisis getting you down? Well, it certainly is for me. And I know there are many people who are feeling the same way. God has a word in his scripture for us, and we're going to look at it today and be reminded to fear not, for the Lord our God is with us. All right, let's take a look at Matthew chapter 28, verses 1 to 10. After the Sabbath, at dawn on the first day of the week, Mary Magdalene and the other Mary went to look at the tomb. There was a violent earthquake, for an angel of the Lord came down from heaven and going to the tomb, rolled back the stone and sat on it. His appearance was like lightning and his clothes were white as snow. The guards were so afraid of him that they shook and became like dead men. The angel said to the women, do not be afraid. For I know that you are looking for Jesus, who was crucified. He is not here. He has risen, just as he said. Come and see the place where he lay. Then go quickly and tell his disciples, He has risen from the dead and is going ahead of you into Galilee. There you will see him. Now I have told you. So the women hurried away from the tomb, afraid yet filled with joy, and ran to tell his disciples. Suddenly Jesus met them. Greetings, he said. They came to him, clasped his feet, and worshipped him. Then Jesus said to them, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brothers to go to Galilee, there they will meet me. So our key verse today, so the women hurried away from the tomb, afraid yet filled with joy, and ran to tell his disciples. Why were they filled with joy? Because Jesus was alive. He was a risen, living Savior. So today, we want to focus on his presence, the Lord with us, and this will take away our fear and give us joy. Let's enjoy this song today and reflect on what Jesus has done for us and that he is ever present in our lives. I 
I hope you enjoyed that song. It has a very good message for us. And we're not going to be afraid anymore because Jesus is here. He's in our midst. And he knows about what we're experiencing presently and about our future with him. I want to pray. Lord God, thank you that you are our God and you are our risen Savior. Lord, we trust in you today. Our fears are gone because you are our risen Savior. And we thank you for that. In Jesus' name, amen. So we'll look forward to seeing you next week, our last session, as we complete this study on joy. God bless you. Have a good week. Bye-bye.